Some of you in New Mexico may have felt a shake or a rumble. It came from an earthquake just outside of Silver City last night. KOAT Action 7 News reporter Mike Springer is here after speaking to a scientist about that 5.2 magnitude quake. Mike. So far, no damage or injuries have been reported with this quake. It happened around 11 o'clock last night. It was about 30 miles outside of Lordsburg, New Mexico, near the Arizona state line just north of I-10. Now, if you were directly in that area at the time of the earthquake, scientists say you'd feel some intense shaking. But if for those who are a little bit further outside, those waves would have spread out further from the quake's epic center. Scientists say then you may have felt more of a rolling sensation. And they say that whole thing may have lasted about 10 or 15 seconds. Now, some people did report feeling the quake's effects as far north as Albuquerque. As has happened with this one, quakes like this can be felt over pretty wide areas. And we had reports it was felt as far as Albuquerque. While scientists say earthquakes down near Silver City are pretty rare, they're not unheard of. In fact, they say they've seen several ones like this uh, just over the last 200 years or so. But scientists say most of the state's magnitude 5 earthquakes tend to occur in the Rio Grande Valley. That's just between Albuquerque and Socorro. Doug and Shelley, back to you. The earliest recorded earthquake in New Mexico was around a 5 magnitude, dating back to 1855 in Socorro. Fire